Every single, basically every single one of the people that I grew up knowing, they're all drug dealers. And this has, this has taken me away from that. This project initially started in 2016 following the uh, murder on the Ivy Bridge estate. Keeps off the streets, keeps out of trouble. Don't get dragged along to fights or anything like that, so it keeps me out of trouble. People were angry, they were afraid. I had a meeting with the residents, the residents were say, say, saying as back then there's not enough on the estates for children. We're talking about gangs who uh, carrying knives and uh, de dealing in drugs, let's be honest about it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, like I used to hang around with a lot of people that uh, were basically no good and coming down to boxing you're hanging around with a lot more positive people. We pick them up, we teach them how to have confidence in themselves, how to hold their heads up and it helps them in their school work, it helps them with their life expectancies. Helped keep me out of trouble because I was quite naughty as a child. <laughs> Get lets you release your anger in the gym so you don't have to do it at school or anywhere else. To keep them out of gangs, to keep them away from crime, to keep them away to show boxing is one of the only sports in the world you do everything yourself. Yeah, there's a lot more to life than just going around and getting in trouble. Just coming here, getting fitter, being out to box is a lot more better. It keeps you out of trouble and it keeps you away from gangs, it keeps you away from everything really what can harm you. And it's like, it's like a family in here because of everyone watches each other's back and we're all good to each other. Everybody's welcome in this gym. Doesn't matter what colour, what race, what religion. Personally, it uh, got me out of like Obviously, yes, like the boys said, like, obviously being affiliated with the gangs and stuff like that within school, and it teaches you, as Bao said, like, discipline within schools and to listen to your teachers a bit more. Yeah. It changes you. That's what it does, it changes you. And it, it like, keeps you away from anything, like, like I said, what can harm you. Just get out of the wrong, don't, don't uh, hang around with the wrong crowd. Just don't get involved with any of it. Because at school, if they're being bullied, then they want to go outside and carry a knife and gives them that sort of false self-confidence and uh, put, gives them that sort of power on them. They can bully someone else to make themselves feel better. So, yeah. It's changed my life just infinitely. Do they carry knives? Uh, some of them did, uh, some of them had guns as well. Uh, yeah, it just helped me focus on a lot of stuff better and just keep away from the wrong people like everyone else. Is. Yeah, because you meet a lot of different people so you respect different people and it's like more diverse. So not everyone comes from the same place or in the same, from the same country. <laughs> Yeah, um, million percent, uh, it's just made me overall a better person in every aspect of my life. <laughs> Never in my wildest dreams would I believe that I would be where I am today. Um, even just being able to say, oh, I am a professional boxer, is just, you can ask anyone who knew me growing up, it was just, it, no one would have ever expected that. We are a boxing family and everybody in the gym, from little kids to professionals to amateurs, 
we bond, we help each other. And if they've got any problems, they bring them to me, or they might talk to their colleagues, and, they, and it just helps them to become a better person. If they're getting fitter, they're getting healthier, they're not going out and doing stuff they shouldn't be doing, they're not committing crimes, it's all above board. So it's a lot better company to have, you know, and that's, um, that's definitely one of the biggest positives and the thing that keeps me coming back.